matter what app or device you're using, all programs rely on cached memory to store frequently used files, functions, and values in order to reduce load times and speed up the user experience. However, if you don't regularly clear cached data, you might notice a drop in your computer's performance. If you're a regular Excel user, it's important to know how to clear your cache from Excel. There are a few ways to speed up your Excel performance by reducing or clearing your cache data, but the easiest way is to disable your recent documents list. Click on the File tab in the main menu of Excel, then scroll down to the bottom of this list to select Excel Options. Open the Advanced tab in this menu, then scroll down until you find the Display section. Where Excel lists show this number of recent documents, set the value to zero. Click OK to save the changes and your recent documents list will remain blank. Next up, you'll want to remove old and unused items in Excel by clearing the Pivot Table cache. Right-click on a cell in the pivot table, then select Pivot Table Options in the context menu that appears. Open the Data tab to change the value of Number of Items to Retain Per Field to None, then click OK to save the changes. These changes will take effect once you right-click on a Pivot Table cell and hit Refresh. Finally, you can also use Microsoft's Visual Basic for Applications program to clear the cache for all pivot tables. Open the file you want to clear your pivot table's cache from, then press Alt and F11 to launch Visual Basic. In the project pane on the left, double click on this workbook to open the code window. Copy and paste the code in the description below. After pasting this code, press the F5 key to clear the cache for all pivot tables in the active workbook. If you liked this guide, make sure you subscribe for all sorts of videos covering Excel and other technology. And don't forget to check out one of these videos we think you might enjoy.